That is the question. Joey, what are you doing? Oh, I was just practicing my acting skills. You know, the actors at the school play sure had some talent. Oh yeah, let's check it out. Winnicunnet's fall play this year was Rumors, a farce written by Neil Simon. The comedic play was originally published in 1988 and has been performed all over the world ever since. Students involved in the production all agreed that Rumors was different from past productions, but nonetheless still fun because of the play's humor. This is my third year in the fall play, and I did tech for one musical. I've done tech all four years of high school. When I was a freshman, I did the musical here, The Music Man, and then I didn't do the fall play that year, and I did the fall play my sophomore year, and I didn't do the musical, and then this year I did the fall play. I think the play went well. I think everyone did fantastic. I felt like this one was actually like, I got the humor and like liked it, and I didn't mind like hearing it like 40 times. Like last year was like a drama rather than this year's comedy. The show went really well. The actors were great, the set turned out really well. Everything was fantastic. So I think the show went extremely well, besides a little, people forgot their lines at certain places, but people covered nicely, and the audio wasn't always where it was supposed to be, and we had to cover for that too, but other than that, it was a really great show. Uh, this show was different from the rest of them, because um, it had one set, which means we were able to focus on it and build it up, while the other shows, um, they've had multiple sets and we weren't able to design one as complex as this one. So this was really different because our set was incredible. We had uh, Mr. Croto put together the set with the, the help of the tech crew, and I think that was the biggest difference, was having a full put together set that wasn't changing every few scenes or whatever because it all took place in the same sort of area and so that really helped. Emily and I also caught up with Mr. Moore who directed the play and talked about why this production was different from the ones he's been involved in in the past 15 years. Um, this is the first play in about 15 years that I directed that wasn't a musical. What made this show tricky was was the fact that uh, because there were no scene changes, uh, the, the play just went from one end to the other uh, without any stops. There was a lot more blocking. Students had to keep track of where they were on stage. They had to keep track of their drinking glasses. Uh, it was pretty complicated in that respect. I, I was thrilled. I didn't know what to expect going into it. Some of the kids I hadn't worked with before and it was different for me not dealing with music and, and just dealing with the stage acting. Uh, but I, th I thought it was great. It wasn't stressful. I enjoyed every minute of it. Uh, Emily, what are you doing? Just practicing my juggling. Well, maybe you should work on your vocal skills because you know the spring musical 9 to 5 is coming up. Oh, you're right. Maybe that would be a good idea. Well, until then, that's all we got for you, Winnicunnet. Peace out. <laughs>